Earthpen. Hello learners, this is Earthpen. Today, we are going to talk about another fun topic in physics. It is all about temperature and thermometers. But before we begin the discussion, if you would like to encourage us to produce more educational content, please show your support by giving a like to the video and subscribing to our channel. You can also help our team grow with your monetary support through our donation PayPal link located in the description below. So what is temperature? Temperature is a measure of how fast the atoms and molecules that make up a substance are moving. This means that the faster the atoms move, the higher the temperature is. So how do we read temperature? Or how do we know what is the temperature of a certain object? We can know the temperature of an object through the reading in a thermometer. So what is a thermometer? A thermometer is an instrument for measuring and indicating temperature. There are a lot of variety of thermometers present nowadays. There are six kinds of thermometer based on how they work. We have manometric, liquid in glass, gas thermometers, bimetallic thermometers, digital thermometers, and infrared thermometers. Let's discuss them one by one. A manometric thermometer determines the temperature based on the change of pressure in a gas or liquid. This type is also known as pressure field or vapor pressure thermometer. Next is the liquid in glass thermometer. It is the oldest type of thermometer. It is actually used in almost anywhere since it is very simple to use. The liquid inside this type of thermometer can either be mercury or alcohol. Next is the gas thermometer. It determines the temperature based on the difference in pressure or volume of the gas it is filled with. Most of the gas thermometers use hydrogen as gas. Biometallic thermometers. They are perfect for higher temperatures as they become less sensitive and accurate at lower temperature. They can be found in many household appliances like stoves. A digital thermometer. It has a thermistor that reacts to the change in temperature and projects the result on the device's screen. And the last kind of thermometer is the infrared thermometer. An infrared thermometer uses thermal radiation that objects emit to measure thermometer. Now let's have a fan fact. Before we proceed, did you know that 57.8 degrees Celsius or 136 degrees Fahrenheit is the hottest temperature ever recorded on Earth? It was recorded on September 13, 1922 in Al Zizaya, located in Libya, and the coldest temperature ever recorded on Earth is negative 89.2 degrees Celsius or negative 128.6 degrees Fahrenheit. It was recorded at Vostok Station located in Antarctica on July 21, 1983. Amazing, right? Now, going back to our topic, temperature is measured in many different scales, including Fahrenheit, Celsius, and Kelvin. Let us tackle them one by one. Celsius, also known as centigrade, was developed by under Celsius in 1742. It is a measure of temperature that is abbreviated by C. Fahrenheit was developed by Gabriel Daniel Fahrenheit in 1714. It is a measure of temperature that is abbreviated with F. Kelvin This was designed by Lord Kelvin William Thomson. It is a measure of temperature that is abbreviated with the letter K. Moreover, Kelvin is a temperature scale designed so that zero Kelvin is defined as absolute zero and the size of one unit is the same as the size of one degree Celsius. The conversion formula for temperature is as follows. Temperature expressed by the Fahrenheit scale can be converted to the Celsius scale equivalent using the equation degrees Celsius is equal to degrees Fahrenheit minus 32 degrees all over 1.8. Similarly, 
temperature expressed by the Celsius scale can be converted to the Fahrenheit scale equivalent using the equation degrees Fahrenheit is equal to 1.8 times degree Celsius plus 32 degrees. Note that a degree Celsius is 1.8 times bigger than 1 degree Fahrenheit. Conversions between Celsius temperature and Kelvin temperature can be performed using the equation Kelvin is equal to degree Celsius plus 273.15. Before we end the video, let us first summarize everything. Today, you learned about temperature, thermometers, type of thermometers, and temperature scales. So, did you enjoy our topic for today? I hope you certainly did. See you again next time for more interesting and fun topics only here in EarthPen. Learning has never been this easy for anyone, anywhere. Have a nice day.